My name is Theresa Thomas, I'm a consultant neurologist here at the Royal Victoria Infirmary in Newcastle and a neuroscientist working at Newcastle University. So the work-life balance in neurology is generally fine. Most neurologists are, are happy with their lot. They're not as burnt out as people doing acute internal medicine. Uh, people have control over their job plan. I think with control means that you don't feel trapped. Um, I think the amount of work you do might depend on whether you have a, a split job. There are lots of clinical academics within neurology and, and so they might be busy but they might be busy because they're recruiting trial patients or traveling around the world to see collaborators. Out of hours, the uh, level of work that you put in probably depends on whether your area looks after stroke, and acute stroke treatment is often a part of the neurologist's out of hours work. There are an increasing number of people working part-time or flexibly within neurology, and the day-to-day -day we're pretty much an outpatient-based specialty. So most neurologists would start at doing three or four clinics a week, on average doing some general neurology and a mixture of their specialty work too.